Yay, it's October! Here is a nail look inspired by The Nightmare Before Christmas and the colors I used are from the Color Effects Collection from Precision Nail Lacquer so definitely check them out. So first you're going to start off with yellow and you're going to put um, cover half your nail with it and this is to create the kind of patchy um, Sally look that from her dress. Um, with the stitches and everything and while you're doing the colors make sure you let them dry a little between and make sure you do thin coats because if you get it too gloppy then they're all going to mix together and then it's going to be a mess so a tip is to let the colors dry before you add the next color and you'll see here that when I add the pink it kind of mess up so I kind of leave it alone and let it dry and then move on to my next nails and just um, try to do second coats of the colors and while you're letting your patchwork dry, you're going to paint your other nail. And on my fourth finger, I'm using Gargantuan Grape by OPI for Sally's skin, since it's kind of a perfect shade for that, actually. And then I go back and do the rest of the patchwork um, to add some final touches to get it darker. And I'm doing my second coat. And then you're going to do your pinky and your pointer white. Once you're done doing all your base colors, then you're going to take your black nail art brush and start adding the stitches on Sally's um, dress patchwork. And I just made a line um, and that way it looks straighter. And you're going to add your stitch marks. and. Then for Jack Skellington's face, I'm taking a big dotting tool and just making slanted ovals. And mine aren't perfect at all. So um, don't worry, it's really easy. If you don't have a dotting tool, you can use a toothpick or a wooden pencil. And then on the pinky, you're just going to do a stitch. And then for Sally, I started off with um, a whole base color of the gargantuan grape so I can outline the face and you're gonna do kind of like a football but rounder so more oval like and then she has a really skinny neck and um, you're gonna add her shoulders and then a stitch mark on her neck and on her shoulder and then you're gonna add her hair and she has bright orange reddish hair so with orange nail polish, I'm just going to take a brush and um, fill in her hair um, on everything that's not her body. And then I'm going to take a thin nail art brush, or you could take your nail art pen, and I'm going to draw her hairline and her hair. And take yellow for her dress and paint part of her shoulder for her dress and then using another a skinny dotting tool I'm going to dry her small beady eyes and again they're very thin and oval and then with a black um, acrylic paint and a thin nail art brush I'm going to outline her eyes and put in her small beady eyes and her small round nose and for her um, lips I use a small dotting tool and red polish then you're gonna let it dry a little and then you're gonna um, draw the rest of her mouth she has kind of like a stitched mouth and you're gonna outline her lips and draw the stitch marks and once you're done with this then you're gonna wait for it to dry and add your favorite top coat I use such feet and then you're done and you have these nightmare before Christmas look and it's perfect for Halloween and it's one of my favorite movies and favorite soundtracks so hope you guys enjoyed it show me your recreations on instagram and visit my website at mod-nails.com